Hello! Good afternoon. This is my first attempt at any sort of vlog and I am terrified that people won't like it. So, fuck it. Let's try it anyway. My name is Paul and I try to make films. I'm writing one at the moment. It's called Locking. I'll tell you more about that later on. I play drums, I play guitar, I love music, I write music. So, I do have a very, very strange opinions about music. I kind of hate most things and hate most new things. I'm kind of stuck in a time warp usually. It's very rarely that someone is so good that I'll actually listen to them constantly. So, I'm kind of very iffy when it comes to people like Justin Bieber. I hate him with a passion. Taylor Swift, hate her. Uh, One Direction, I want them all to die individually once they watch each other die. That figure. But one thing that has encouraged me today was uh, Benjamin Cook's becoming YouTube. I think it is amazing. It's a documentary basically documenting trends and the kind of culture around YouTube. I'm kind of really interested by it, but I'm also kind of encouraged a little to try it out. If I fail, I fail. If I fail, it's documented on YouTube and anyone can laugh at it. But if I get AdSense, I'd be sorted. I'd be rich with my failures. So technically, if I do fail and it ends up on YouTube and goes viral, it's not a failure. Well, my dignity might be uh, a bit bruised, but oh well, could be worse. Could be in one direction. One direction. You yeah, haven't noticed already. But one thing I am writing is a kind of short film. It's based in a bar. It's nothing like uh, Cheers. It's absolutely nothing like Cheers. People have kind of compared it to Cheers. But what it is is it's called Lockin, and it is about eight, eight lads who work inside a bar, and they're loving it. They get a phone call from their, the bar's owner who lives in Spain and he doesn't know anything about the bar, he just knows about it on paper. So the lads get a phone call from the owner and he says he's shutting shop as soon as the night is over. And the lads haven't been pay paid in quite a while, so they stage a sit-in protest which evidently turns into a lock-in which, if you don't know what a lock-in is, it's an uh, after-hours drinking session inside a pub that is kind of illegal um, if you had cost paying customers. So, it's not illegal if it's the bar staff, but they are staging a sitting in the pub, and that could be a lot of fun to watch. So, I'm hoping to get help from friends, that's why I'm on this today as well, because I want people on YouTube to let me know what they think of it, and probably get some practice in editing videos, and probably get a bit more uh, notice about everything I'm doing. I could document everything I'm doing, I could document the filming if I can, but at the moment I don't have that much cameras. This camera is kind of lent me by college, so I have to buy a camera. That could be troublesome, especially when you're broke. I'm broke. Yay. But Paul, what are you doing next week? Ah, well I have a very special guest coming over here just to talk to you about it. I am doing Shave or Die. Basically, a charity um, event where you dye your hair or you shave it. I'm dyeing my hair, whatever colour Facebook or YouTube decides. I have kind of most, most of the people at the moment are going for pink. So 
so my hair could be very interesting pink. And the aim is um, punks versus monks. And it looks like my hair is going to be bright pink. I don't think that's um, the punk I'm thinking of. So, um, sex pistols. They have dyed, um, Johnny Rotten has dyed hairbrush in pink. It's going to be very, very, very ridiculously awesome. But it's for a good cause, it's for the Irish Cancer Society. And I have no problem in donating my head as a embarrassment beacon. Just for this. It'll be fun. I'm making a time lapse video of the whole project. Because I have dark hair, and if you're not familiar with uh, bleaching your hair, it usually takes a few hours and kills most of your hair, so I'll probably be bald by the end of it. But um, I'll have to have it bleached, and then after that, I'm dyeing it candy fucking pink. Yeah, Woo! I'm gonna get so many ladies with that. Or to save people's lives. Yay, just such a nice person! But please tell me if I'm a failure and I probably can improve on some things, but I got bored. I have a camera. I have editing software, which knocked over the light. And I have a green screen. Um, if you haven't noticed, that's not a baby panda behind me at all. I wish it was. Pandas are fucking cool. But I'm, I'm just kind of experimenting. So if you like it, please subscribe to me or just leave a comment below in that yoke. Most people call it the doobly do. What the fuck is that? Oh well. See you later.